Today, we are explaining my PhD results with dance. And we have dancers from different backgrounds showing different kangaroo personalities and how those personalities affect group behavior, group responses. So we are going to remake some kangaroo footage from my fieldwork. My fieldwork was at Wilson's Promontory National Park at the southern point of Australian mainland using eastern grey kangaroos. So I've got some footage from my experimental tests and some from real life behavior like kangaroo fight. So I have a friend here today and we're gonna follow one of the videos we have and try to replicate, but not trying to make it cheesy, but using like some fights like Brazilian capoeira. So you're gonna kick me. That'll be cool. What we found is that individuals do have personalities, mean they behave different from each other and consistent to themselves across time. But when they're in groups, they tend to adjust more. And this adjustment is actually democratic. So all the individuals, they copy the behavior from each other. And then the group response is a perfect average of the personality of everybody there. So it's very cool. So we've got three kangaroos there and you are my three kangaroos in real life. We studied kangaroos behavior variation and now we're trying to replicate or communicate that using humans. So what did I thought? Oh, dancers, they move in different ways, particularly dancers from different styles. So we got people from ballet, from Brazilian funk, um, various other rhythms like salsa, samba as well. And then we put these people together and show how personality affects group responses or group dynamics. So it's been really fun conveying my results into dance. It's probably one of the most creative aspects of my PhD life and of my life in general. I've never done anything so challenging. I think it was a pretty cool project and I hope you enjoy the final cut of it.